Hey, it's Jordan from Countryside Plumbing. So I've installed a Zoller Aquanaut battery backup sump pump today, and this is the way that it works. Here you have a, a readout, digital readout with some controls. You can press this button here, it says scroll. You're not gonna be able to see this on the video, but it tells you the amps on the battery, um, how many times that the alternating current has failed, how many times the power has shut off to the house, or you have unplugged it, or the breaker is gone, uh, the name of the company, their 800 number, um, and then it just scrolls right here, uh, the voltage and the charging amps. Um, there's a button right here, alarm reset. You can press that one time and it'll turn the alarm off. You can hold it for, th uh, or sorry, if the, you can hold it for three seconds, the alarm will turn off for 24 hours. Uh, if, you, if the alarm is going on and you press it once, it'll turn the alarm off. Um, so now the alarm is activated. See, there's no light here. Uh, you'll get a light here that says pump cycled if the pump cycles. So here's how it works. Down here in the hole, we have our primary pump right here, which is a uh, Wayne. Uh, half horsepower It's tested to a million cycles. Um, it's a vertical float, so when this float rises up, you can hear that activate right there, it clicks the pump off. Now right here, hanging above that, above that float, is the float for the battery backup. That's the Zoller pump right there. This is the battery backup. So if I lift this right here, you're going to hear the alarm go off and it's going to actuate the backup pump. Okay. Now, that beeping noise is telling us that the alarm went, that the pump cycled. Let's see, let it get a good cycle. Okay, so you're gonna get home from work or going out to dinner or whatever and the pumps, you're gonna hear this noise. And what you're gonna do, first thing you're gonna do is come down here and there's a light here that says pump cycled. Press this reset button one time. That'll turn that annoying alarm off. Now you need to scroll through here and see what's happened. Now it's telling us that this pump has run nine times as a run count. I know you can't see this. As I, you know, as I was out of the house, uh, there's, let's say, for, for example, there's an AC failure. So then I'm going to come back over here and I'm going to look, okay, well, here's where I'm plugged in. Is it plugged in? Yes. Is the breaker in good shape? Yes, the breaker's in good shape. Well, we must have lost power today and my backup sump pump went. The other thing you want to do when that alarm goes off is come down here into your, into your pit and make sure that your primary pump, sometimes it's a tether float, sometimes it's a vertical switch, make sure that your primary pump is working. Sometimes that backup pump goes off because your primary pump went out and uh, you that, that means that your primary pump has failed and needs to be replaced. Okay, good luck guys with everything. Um, that's how that Aquanaut 508 system works. Again, it's Jordan from Countryside Plumbing. Thank you.